All right, so yeah, I've seen this kind of around the grapevine. Uh, people discussing it. My, my friends kind of talked about it a little bit earlier this week. It's on Twitter and whatnot. But yeah, Bohemian Grove, uh, let's talk about it. I'm not going to lie, we talked about it like multiple times on this channel, and I kind of went in depth into it on the Conspiracy Theory Iceberg Tier 1. However, that video got removed due to somebody that I talked about on the iceberg doing this whole legal rigmarole with... Uh, YouTube, it's it's some horse doo doo, but I'm gonna have to remake that video. The Bohemian Grove, yes, it's a real thing. It's a private, exclusive, and secretive retreat located in Monte Rio, California, owned by the Bohemian Club, and this is basically just quote a private gentleman's club in San Francisco, and it was founded in 1872 by a group of journalists, artists, and musicians seeking a place for relaxation and camaraderie away from the bustle of city life. Now, the location itself, the grove, spans like 2,700 acres of redwood forest along the Russian River, and it provides a secluded and tranquil environment for the members. It's worth noting that the members in this club are predominantly male and white males, and it has historically been an elite gathering of influential figures from various fields such as politics, business, academia, and the arts. Hell, Ronald Reagan and Nixon were even in the club. Now, one of the most infamous aspects of this Bohemian Grove is its annual summer encampment, where members, along with invited guests, gather for a two-week-long retreat, typically in July. During this time, they host a series of lectures, performances, and social activities. However, what catches most of the attention and speculation from outsiders are the rituals and ceremonies that take place, particularly the cremation of care ceremony. Now, on Honestly, without the cremation of care, this would just look like a summer camp for, for rich guys. But this ceremony kind of makes things look really occult and really kind of weird. Now, the ceremony is held at the beginning of the encampment and is apparently a symbolic theatrical performance where participants, dressed in elaborate costumes, enact the burning of a wooden effigy representing, quote, care or worldly concerns. And it's interpreted as a symbolic ritual to shed worries and distractions and allow the attendees to focus on fellowship and relaxation during their time at the Grove. Now, despite the Bohemian Grove's reputation for secrecy and exclusivity, details about the activities and attendees have been occasionally leaked to the public over the years. Now, one of the reasons reasons I want to bring this up is um so there's this guy Ryan Garcia and if you haven't heard of him he's a pretty good boxer apparently he's he's going around spreading statements now we don't we don't know necessarily if this is like side effects of CTE or if he's being for real but he's talked about how um, he was attending one of these Bohemian Grove getaways or whatever. And he had had a situation in which he was forced to watch uh, people, rape kids, um, yeah, take that with a grain of salt. It's coming out of his mouth, not mine. Do I believe it? Nah, not really. I don't, I don't think they would operate like that now as sketchy i'm sure they get it to i'm sure they get up to some real sketchy shit here but then again i i don't know shit you know and now back to this cremation of care ceremony because this is one of the most like i guess creepiest parts of the bohemian grove depending on how you interpret it but it's it's a really theatrical performance there's actually video footage uploaded online and you could actually watch the ceremony and it takes place in front of a large stone owl known as the cremation of care altar situated near a small lake within the grove's grounds and the altar and surrounding area are illuminated with torches creating an eerie and dramatic atmosphere the participants involves members of the bohemian grove and invited guests all dressed in elaborate costumes and they work together in bringing the performance to life now, the central theme of this ceremony is representing the release of worldly concerns and distractions, and the care figure is depicted as a human effigy, or a dummy, that symbolizes the burdens and anxieties of daily life. And burning this effigy is meant to symbolize the desire to rid oneself of these burdens, allowing for the period of relaxation and camaraderie that the Grove members then take throughout the two weeks you guys should probably watch actually watch the ceremony for yourselves again get your own opinion on on all this kind of stuff 
but yeah, I mean, that's really what it is. Um, look, at face value, though Bohemian Grove is just a country club for really, really, really rich guys. Underscoring it, maybe. I mean, like, we could get into all types of conspiracy theories. Uh, look, you could, you could talk about the deep state. You could get into the whole Epstein thing, child trafficking. I've heard some people as, go as far as to say as these people, like, uh, get, like, super drunk and just form sexual acts on one another and try to use it as blackmail because uh, apparently a lot of these guys have influence on certain aspects of the world and try to you know get one ups on one another or even try to use this to get others to comply with how they want to quote run the world um that is if you believe in all that i mean you know i've told you what it is at face value of course you could get into all these different fun conspiracy theories on what it kind of represents or what kind of sketchy stuff goes on there but no doubt it is creepy itself pretty weird but yeah man i'm really upset that the conspiracy theory iceberg tier one video got removed i'm gonna have to redo that shit but anyways yeah that's the bohemian grove hope you guys enjoyed the video and uh yeah i'm gonna catch you next time bro i love you